What is good everybody and welcome back to the channel. So today I'm excited because I'm buying a lot of new clothes from my closet. A lot of you guys might not have seen it, some of you might have. It was a video that had a little bit less views than usual on my channel, so I don't know how many of you guys saw it. But I decided to go ahead and sell a bunch of stuff out of my closet, which I don't know if you guys can see, but like right there, I don't know if it's on there. Right there is the pile that's gonna be going on my website actually in the next few days. I'm gonna try to get as much of it as I can tonight. To sell so I decided to do a purge of my closet and basically sell everything I just don't wear like there's a lot of stuff that I didn't wear and I just am not gonna wear so decided to go ahead and hook you guys up a lot of this is gonna be going on my website so I'll be listing that down below I'm gonna do 25 items at a time so we're gonna see how that kind of goes okay guys it is Tuesday current day when this video is going live I wanted to pop in here and tell you guys tomorrow at 6 p.m. Eastern that's Wednesday January 31st at 6 p.m. Eastern I want to do a live stream where I sell everything. I want to give away some mystery boxes, some hypebeast mystery boxes, some clothing mystery boxes, as well as put together some bundles for different mystery boxes. So if you guys want to go ahead and be there tomorrow, 6 p.m. Eastern, January 31st, on this YouTube channel, I'm going to hopefully do some more in the future, but I'm going to be doing everything with selling it, putting it on the website, so some of you guys can grab it in live time when everything goes up. I'll say, who wants this? Put it up, sell it. So if you guys can be there and enjoy the video. But you guys got to look out for that in the next few days. And that is the reason why this video is possible because I'm selling a lot of clothes to buy what I want. That's a very fortunate thing that I have because I have a lot of clothes so I can just sell them and you know make some of the money back that I, I'm not going to make it all back because I've worn a lot of this stuff. But make some money back and then put it back in my videos, get some new stuff for you guys. So that's what we're doing today. We're going to show you guys a bunch of different stuff. Now, I'm not going to like pack some H&M and all that today for these specific videos. For this part of like the closet restock that I'm doing, I'm going to be going to smaller companies' websites that I've just found throughout the years. I just like the brand, and I'm going to be going with them for certain things. And there's no hype from the companies I put up. I don't really think there's much hype in here. There's no Supreme, Bape, Louis Vuitton, Gucci, nothing like that. It's just genuine brands that I really like and stuff that I wanted to buy to go ahead and fill in my closet. And it's also kind of a weird time of the year right now just because, you know, it's becoming warmer but it snowed last week but it's 70 this past weekend so i'm just trying to figure out like what exactly to do but i'm not gonna i'm gonna try to keep this a little bit moving and like and like be a little bit more moving around so you guys aren't just sitting in the same spot so we're gonna get onto my computer go ahead and just buy like whatever i want now it might be you know i think i calculated it out we might be close to a thousand bucks i don't know we'll go ahead and see but we're just buying stuff that i just genuinely want so we're gonna head to my computer and pull up the different websites now i just basically want to show you guys the different websites and i'm gonna surf through a little bit and just kind of talk about them now we're just gonna surf through a few different websites to show you and not do like a full bunch of searching because i don't want to take too long doing that but i pulled up a majority of the stuff that i want right now and what i'm looking at and then we'll kind of go through what's going to be next as far as what i'm getting and then when they come in, I'll obviously unbox them and show you guys the like more updating of my closet. I guess I'll go ahead and show you guys my closet actually and how it's looking right now once we go ahead and uh, finish up with the shopping. So I did want to come in here and update you guys on what's going on in the closet, what is gone already. You guys can probably see it a little bit, but basically this is the majority of what I have left for the main stuff, which it looks like more. Those are all empty hangers. These are all the shirts that I have left. There's three, nine... 12 there's probably 15 to 20 shirts left which i know might seem like a lot but if you guys see what i'm selling it's crazy and then the jackets these are all the jackets i kept left and a few here now again some of the stuff i am keeping because it was sent out to me or you know has some sentimental value to me and then the pants up here i condensed to 15 pairs of these ones those are sweatpants i just got but 15 pairs which i should probably condense more but i want to keep a little bit you know more of those colors going but there's also this kind of blank area here. So basically, this is a pile of clothes that I'm getting rid of and selling. There's just a lot of stuff in here. Like, I've got this t-shirt. There's another essential t-shirt. There's hoodies. There's Jake Paul merch, if you guys want that. There's just so much stuff that I'm getting rid of. I'm going to be I'm gonna be packaging a lot of it in mystery boxes and doing like five items for 25 bucks. I'm going to be doing, you know, 50 bucks for five items. I'm going to show you guys what's in there and put pictures of what's in there and what you're getting so you know what you're getting and the sizes but it's still also gonna be just like a combined offer. Not like a mystery box, because that is very random. But I still have things like the Supreme hat. I guess I could sell this on StockX if I wanted to. But there are just a ton of stuff in here that I'm gonna be getting rid of. Some pants, some like denim, sweatshirts. I even got like this Pablo t-shirt all the way at the bottom. Kanye West from the pop-up here. Justin Bieber merch from the Purpose Tour, that's here. There's a lot of stuff, and I wanna show you guys some of it in, uh, it'll be up for sale soon. I don't have an exact time. I would hope by tonight I can get majority of it listed, but I'm very tired. I've been up early. I want to get to sleep, but 
Gotta work, boys. So let's go ahead and show some of these things. So I did pull up PacSun. The first thing I wanted to do is get something from Pleasures. Now, Pleasures is a company I have one t-shirt from them, and I saw it at ComplexCon, and I decided they're a company I really like as far as their designs are simple, but they have a little bit of a graphic on there. A lot of the time, it doesn't really say their brand, and it doesn't have to have like branding, but they have like cool like pictures and everything like that. Now, one of the things with them is they do have some like weird pictures that I don't really want. Like this one, it's like a cigarette being burnt out on a tongue. Not really about that, but I'm trying to do things that are like half long sleeve, some short sleeve, and crew necks, different things like that. But there's one shirt that was actually already pulled up, but a lot of the stuff they have is Grateful Dead, which I know Grateful Dead, I know some of their music, but I'm not the biggest fan. So I just don't really wanna be kind of like wearing it if I'm not the biggest fan of them. But the shirt that I liked was this one here and it is the space long sleeve. So I don't know really size to get. Now I'm trying not to do like a bunch of oversized stuff. I do wanna do, you know, just like regular fitting stuff. This one is pretty regular fitting. The sleeve's a little bit longer, but the waist size, it kind of fits me better, like how low it goes to the waist. So I think I'm gonna do a large for that. And you know, I don't know why I'm like buying it with that, like I could have bought it beforehand and showed you guys, but I guess I'm just gonna go through the process really quick. Bam, we got the first order, 47 bucks, not too shabby, you know? We're not really trying to spare too many expenses right now, just because, like, we're not trying, I'm not trying to worry about how much something costs, because I just wanna buy genuinely what I like, and I know that I'm gonna be able to make some of the money back off of this. I've already sold a bunch of stuff. I made a few hundred dollars selling to some friends, just some of the stuff that I don't wear, and so there's a lot left for you guys to go ahead and buy if you want it. Another one that I wanted to do was from Born and Raised. Now, I learned about Born and Raised from Jacob Starr just because he talks about them a lot in his videos. And there's a bunch of cool different stuff that they have. I'm a more simplistic type of person when it comes to their different designs because there's a lot of stuff that might have like some controversy in it. There's ones with like the big Born and Raised logo, which I kind of like this one, but I don't, I'd rather have a more simplistic design. I don't know, that's a, 90 bucks is a little bit, like I just said, I wasn't worried about prices, but I did like this shirt here. It is the Heather Gray corporate shirt. Very plain, says born and raised on the front, Los Angeles. Very simple shirt, nothing crazy there. And so I like that one. I'm gonna go ahead and cop it in a size large. I think I'm a size large in most stuff. I just, you know, that's my go-to. There's no model for me to kind of go after what to wear, but that's what I'm gonna do. So while I'm going ahead and processing this, I did wanna let you guys know if you watched the last video, please go check it out. I did a video with Sophie where she reacted to some of my new clothes because I'm getting new stuff for the closets and whatnot. But I did a video and I talked about I'm getting my haircut soon. And so I'm getting my haircut on Friday or Saturday. And I'm gonna be filming the whole thing and doing a video out of it. I did wanna show you in this video, particularly my grooming tips, because I don't really talk about it that much. But I wanna show you guys, I teamed up with Dollar Shave Club for this video so they can make this possible as well. So I'm gonna cut that really clip really quick. And then we're gonna come back and then we're gonna finish up buying all this stuff. And then we're gonna head to the closet and show you guys what we're looking like. Actually, I might have already done that because now thinking about it, I feel like it'd be better to show you guys beforehand what my closet looks like before I buy all this stuff. All right, guys. So I wanted to incorporate grooming into my videos because I have never really talked about it before. And I decided to go ahead and throw it in here in like a little bit different style of a video. And I do have to give a huge shout out to Dollar Shave Club for sponsoring this video. Now, I've actually gotten Dollar Shave Club before because because another YouTuber that I watch, H3H3, actually talked about it on his podcast, and it made sense to me, and I said, you know what, let's go ahead and grab it. And so now Dollar Shave Club actually reached out to me to go ahead and make a video, and I get to share it with you guys, my experience and everything like that, because, you know, when you go to a store, and if you don't shave a lot, or if you do, it's a little different for each person, but I don't shave too often, and I would say too often as in like every three days, because if I say that's often, people who have to shave every day will kill me, and I know that I'm blessed to only have to shave like every three days. But basically, there are a ton of options in the store, and if you're sick and tired of the different options in the store, and the nonsense of just trying to deal with it, it's time to try Dollar Shave Club. For a limited time, they're giving away their shit shower and shave pack or starter set to new members for only five bucks. Now, a whole cartridge of new razors costs five dollars at minimum. So, their starter set has their executive razor in their three trial size versions of their most popular products for you guys to go ahead and try out. In the first box, you'll receive the shave butter, the body wash, and their one wipe trolleys. You'll also receive their executive razor, which has a weighted handle and a full cassette of cartridges. After the first box, replacement cartridges are sent to you guys for only a few bucks each month. So, I'm going to go ahead and open up my box right here just so I can show you guys a little bit of what it's like. You know, you got the shave time, shave money. That's pretty funny right there. Dollar Shave Club on the side. 
I just think it's a great idea in general. And you know, I have just a select part of my face that I shave because I'm not the hairiest, like I said, but it is key to have the importance of doing that when you actually shave. So welcome to your better bathroom. It's just got a lot cooler in there. So we got some nice little cool packaging here. Let's open this up. Bam, bam, bam. I think that's all we got in there. Let's put that to the side. Mince meat, not your face. Change your blade each week. So we got four different blades here. Dang. This has five blades on it. So like I said, I'm not an expert when it comes to the different razors and stuff like that. And the people in the store aren't either whenever I go there. But it's all different experiences based off of people and how they shave and different things. But like, as you can see, we've got the four cartridges now. From what I've seen on commercials and different things, five blades is like key if you're trying to get, you know, a good shave. Now it looks, you got the lubricating on the top. Man, we're about to be, we're about to be fresh out here. Okay, so here's the kit. You have a very important decision to make, DSC Everyday Trial Kit. You're about to form a very good habit. Let's open this up. The Beep Shower and Shave Trial Kit. We got the One Wipe Charlies. You already know, guys. We got the Body Cleanser right here, and then we have the Shea Butter, which I've actually been tempted to try the Shea Butter just because whenever I do shave, it's kind of tough because the part that I shave, then we got the camera, is like right here because that's the part that I, you know, go all the way down, and this is, I kind of line this up here. When I shave that, it's kind of rough there, so... Shave butter is going to be perfect for that. This offer is exclusively available at dollarshaveclub.com slash Harrison. So if you guys would go ahead and check it out, it will be in the description as well. But again, that is dollarshaveclub.com slash Harrison. Okay, we're back sitting here, different clothes, but it's okay. Because that was filmed a little bit earlier just because it's a little bit later now. Things that happen, Fortnite update, I had to play a game. But you know, it's, it's whatever we're going now. Second order done, 67 bucks. Not, you know, that's a little bit up there for a t-shirt, but... This is what you get when you shop at these places. And honestly, I don't think $67 is that crazy because t-shirts get up there. I've got, you know, there's t-shirts that are four or $500, my Gucci t-shirt. I actually no longer have that t-shirt. I ended up selling it to a friend just because I don't really wear it. It's very, you know, very flashy. And I just, I don't know, I felt when I wore it, I just felt like I was doing too much. So I got rid of that one. Now I wanted to look at Misfits Rep or Misfits or just Jaden Smith's brand in general. I like a bunch of the different clothes. Now some of it is like merch for his, like new album sire or new whatever is going on with it i do really like this one not looking at it like it's a pretty cool shirt and i either wanted to get this one or like this t-shirt here now um, i like a few of these actually there's this one here oh they sold out i was gonna go for this one i'm gonna go for the black one just because that's i feel like i would wear it more but you know that's fine 60 bucks that's like as much as the t-shirt for the last one 60 and so that's different because I was gonna go for the other shirt But I guess it sold out before the time that I could actually go ahead and buy it. So snooze you lose I guess so go in here Jaden Smith take my money. I do like his song icon I don't know if you guys are familiar with it. I'm assuming you are $10 shipping right another 70 bucks We're up there. So I did want to get something for or actually from C2H4 now if you see that hoodie Kappa hoodie I wear all the time It's Kappa and C2H4 collab it was like 160 bucks at ComplexCon, it sold out. They're selling for like 350 bucks right now. But they have a bunch of cool different things that they, you know, that they sell, but they're sold out. And so I found a really cool gray hoodie that I really liked. And their stuff is more expensive. I found a gray hoodie I really, really liked. It was different right here, the post-war hoodie. It's got like spots, it's like gray. It's so dope. It's got like distressing up here, 180 bucks. They only have a size medium, and my one from them is a large or extra large. Oh, that's so dope. It's like distressed with an embroidery around it, and it's got the color in it. That is sick. That's so sweet. Maybe I'll have to wait for their new, like, spring line coming out. Okay, next one is from X Large, and I'm just going to pop to this one just because we're here. So extra large, I've seen our X large is another one that was I think at ComplexCon, or I've seen a bunch of their hats in the past. But this is a cool shirt. It's like the eight bit shirt, so it's got the design of like an old game. Like I I used to play arcade games back in the day so much. It just reminds me a lot of that. Reminds me a lot of the Space Invaders game that I used to play back in the day. But this is one that I thought I could get in a different color. So they have white and the gray. Now I bought a gray shirt, I bought a black shirt. I gotta buy a white one. So I'm gonna go with a size. Oh wait, this color is white size large add to cart 64 bucks these people are taxing on this i'm trying to like balance the whole not buying hype but not buying too like because like you know i like to get a good deal on stuff and this is a lot of stuff this is brands but like i have so many essentials i'm selling so many essentials when my friend was buying stuff out there yesterday he's like this is insane like this nobody needs this many clothes 
And that was me selling, I've sold like half of the stuff that was in there and I'm just trying to condense because like it's, it gets to a point where I just, I can't wear everything. And so like essentials, I have so many black t-shirts and so many white t-shirts, so many different shirts that if I have to like, now that's why I'm going for this kind of stuff because I've got all the essentials, I got the perfect fitting essentials, everything that I need. And now I just need more of the regular stuff that I wear on like, a, I guess a typical basis. So I think this is the last one that I'm going to be getting 70 bucks, spending about 500 bucks order confirmed. So a lot of these are probably gonna take a little while to get here. But again, it's okay because we'll do another unboxing video like the one where I bought all the ads that I saw. So this one, you know, we got some t-shirts at C284, which are kind of cool, but I don't need any black t-shirts. You guys know that. Oh, the 10 deep. So there's also a 10 deep one that I wanted to buy. Let's see, size large. It's like a black one. I have so many black shirts. I need to get something different. Ooh, what about yellow? I'd be down to get something yellow. So they've got a lot more stuff in here than I thought that I saw originally. Let's see, where where did that one even go that I was looking at? Trying this one more time, and if it doesn't go through, I'm going to sleep and I'm not buying. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I think oh, it's not going through. So I guess it's not meant to be for me to get this one. I don't know what's going on. I might have to go back through and get that. I'll have to let you guys know if I do get it. I probably just had to blur that out. But I know that's not more of a typical video, but it was a little bit fun to go ahead and show you guys just things I wanted to get that's not necessarily all hype. So we'll have to go ahead and do an unboxing when that comes in. And you know, again, keep an eye out for all the stuff going online. I'll see you guys next time. This is Eric Sanders. Signing out. I don't know where I'm going, I just know where I'm headed, feel this song.